on the this and that section, we have one new item. We have added our chili as an item available daily. This is a powerhouse of fiery southwestern flavor and our own blend of seasonings. Changes to this section include the recipe for our hummus. We have omitted the sour cream from our hummus recipe, making it dairy-free, which also makes it a fully vegetarian item. Monster Nachos will now have a choice of beef, chili, or our guest can upgrade to pulled pork for $3. Chicken nachos will no longer be listed on the menu, but will still be available as a secret menu item. The chicken quesadilla will be listed as simply a quesadilla and will feature the same recipe, but is now available with your choice of chicken or pulled pork for a $2 upcharge. Items removed from this section of the menu include tap room fries. This item will no longer be available. Servers may want to suggest a tub of sweet potato fries with a side of honey Dijon dipping sauce. The world famous bar bite section. We have one new item here and those are the pulled pork bites. These are delicious tender bites filled with our own slow cooked juicy pork on top of our handcrafted slaw and served with chipotle aioli. They are available as a single order with three bites or a double order with six bites. We have removed from this section the turkey bites. This item will now be known as a secret menu item and is still available as we still prep the ingredients. There's one major change to be aware of in this section and that is that all bar bite dishes will now be listed as single or double. In the vegging out section, we have not added any items and we have not removed any items. There's one major change to be aware of, and that is the salad formerly known as the app salad has been renamed as the house salad. I repeat, the salad formerly known as app salad has been renamed house salad. In the homegrown burger section, we have added no new items. We have removed the buffalo chicken burger. This item will no longer be available as we will no longer be carrying the ingredients. If a guest asks for this item, servers may want to suggest the buffalo chicken wrap or the choice chicken sandwich tossed in buffalo sauce. One major change to be aware of in this section is that all homegrown burgers will be served on a wood board with a fry cup. Please note that these are still in production and will be rolled out to all locations as they become available. The veggie hummus wrap is now a vegan item. The Turkey Carver Club will now be known simply as the Turkey Carver and will be cut in half instead of four ways. A new item in this section is the Baja Veggie Burger, which is a sweet and spicy blend of black beans, chipotle, corn, and sweet potato, served with leaf lettuce, pico de gallo, house-made guacamole, and topped with crunchy tortilla strips. This item can be made vegan if ordered with a wheat wrap. The Portobello Burger will now be offered as a grilled Portobello wrap. The ingredients will remain the same. This item can now be made vegan if you omit the cheese from the final presentation. The Marina Sandwich will now be served on a brioche roll instead of the whole grain wheat roll. Major changes to be aware of in this section are that all items in this section will now be served on a rectangle plate with a fry cup. In the pasta section, we have one new item, and that is the penne a la vodka. This is penne pasta and local peas tossed in a smooth, creamy sauce made with tomatoes, cream, and a splash of vodka topped with grated Reggiano cheese. Guests may add grilled chicken for $3.49 or pan-seared shrimp for $4.99. We have removed from this section the angel hair pasta. This item will now be known as a secret menu item and is still available as we still prep the ingredients. In the pizza section, we have no new items. Removed from this section is the spinach and artichoke pizza. This item will be known as a secret menu item and is still available upon request. In the steak section, we have two new items. The filet medallions, which are perfectly seasoned, fork tender, topped with our delicious Bordelais sauce. Each medallion is three ounces and the dish is offered in either six ounce or nine ounce portions. This item replaces the filet mignon. We also have the filet cut top sirloin. This is thick, juicy, and full of flavor and this item replaces the top sirloin. The new menu will have a section called by land or by sea. 
This section will take the place of the chicks and pork section as well as the seafood section. In the by land or by sea section, we have no new items. We have removed the chicken marsala, which will no longer be available. We have also removed the chicken tender platter, which will be now known as a secret menu item and is still available. We have a new section called Wicked Good Sides, listing all of our side dish options. In this section, we have five new items, and those are the Parmesan tater tots, Parmesan fries, roasted fingerling potatoes, roasted Brussels sprouts, and grilled asparagus. Green beans will no longer be available as a side. We have revamped our side dish pricing program. Add-on sides will incur a full price charge of either $2.99 for a single order or $4.99 for a double order. This includes all pastas, all pizzas, all items on this and that section except for the chicken tenders. Subsides on dishes with one side will incur a minimal charge. This includes all homegrown burgers, all burgers, wraps, and sandwiches, and chicken tenders.